Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Asia Rising Forever. It's your girl, Nikki. So I'm super excited because Panda Express and 88 Rising have partnered together to celebrate Asian Heritage Month. I know it's been a really weird time and it's been a really difficult time for a lot of people. So we're just here celebrating you. We're celebrating us. To those of you who don't know me, I'm a singer, songwriter, producer. I'm from Indonesia. And today I'm going to be making Panda Express's original orange chicken. Yeah! Also shout out to 88 Rising and Panda Express both for being trailblazing titans for the Asian community, introducing Asian culture to America and the world. Okay, so at the end of this video, I'm going to be comparing my homemade version with the actual Panda Express orange chicken. And we're going to see if I failed, which I probably will because I talked up a big game. The first time I ate Panda Express was in college. I wasn't super acquainted with all the Asian restaurants nearby at that point. So I was just like, Panda Express, let's do it. Probably every single weekend. I'd make my friends drive me to Panda Express and I would just get myself a big piping hot bowl of rice and chicken. And it made me feel right at home. All right. Let's just get right to it. I'm really scared. All right, first we're gonna make the batter, the glorious golden batter. Flour, do the cornstarch, salt, and the pepper. Ooh. Oh my God, I forgot to get an egg. We need an egg. All right, egg. Also, I don't have an apron. I don't know why. Um, just never thought to invest in an apron. Oil, and we need the water. This is one and a half cups of water. This is really ASMR, honestly. Okay, I feel like this is gonna take a long time, so I'm just gonna fast forward. Cool, where's the chicken? Here's the chicken. Thankfully, the chicken has been pre-cut up, so that really helps me out. All right. Ooh, okay, dope. I feel like, yeah, time to switch tools. So we're gonna use this handy dandy red spatula that has literally been with me forever. By the way, if you touch chicken, wash your hands with soap, as you should be anyway during this time. Okay, so now we're gonna put this in the fridge for at least 30 minutes. Ta-da! Fire. All right, let's move over to the stove. Okay. Okay, so the thermometer read 350. So now I'm gonna put in the chicken. We're gonna set the timer for five minutes. Oh, no, 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 no. May have added too much batter, but we'll see. Okay, so we're just gonna run the fan because it gets hot. Ooh, look at it. Strong comfort food vibes, y'all. All right, y'all, so it's been five minutes. Cool. Sauce time. I, one time all I did was literally heat up oil and I set off my entire apartment's uh, smoke alarm. So I'm still a great cook though. My methods may be a little clunky, but the end product is what matters. And usually the end product is more often than not fire. Okay, so now I just have to wait for the oil to shimmer, which means that it's hot, which means that it's time for sauce. So this is a big walk. Okay, I feel like that's kind of shimmery, so add the red pepper flakes, ginger, garlic. Oh God, mmm, so splattery. Okay, brown sugar. Woo, she is packed. Sugar, fire, orange, ooh! I didn't know that it actually had orange juice in it. I really thought that it was just like an orange colored chicken. Ah, it's so caramely. It's like toffee up in here. Okay, I feel like the sugars have dissolved. So we're now gonna add the vinegar and we're gonna add the soy sauce. Delicious! Whisk to combine, all right. Got a cute little whisk. This whisk's whole life has led up to this moment, so don't let me down. All right, she's thick. Well, at least starting to get there. She's working out right now. Yes, girl, get them gains. Get thick. I wouldn't relate, so. Okay, so she is really thick, but for some reason the cornstarch is literally still like not going away. Gotta represent. They gonna kill me. Maybe if I like put it to one side and like do that. I feel like I will live. 
I will, we will live with this. It'll be fine. My whole life has been leading up to this moment. Look at this, y'all. Are you hearing this? It feels so crunchy. Mmm. The crispy. I'm gonna talk with my mouth closed because that is rude, sorry. The crispy bits are like the best part. There we go. Mmm. This looks so yummy. Girl, you got that yum, yum. No, well, I'm on way. Yeah, babe, yeah, babe. Ooh. Mmm. Look at that. Are you seeing this? Why am I not a chef? Like, why don't I have a restaurant? <laughs> Gordon Ramsay, where you at? Hit me up. Hit my line. Okay, guys. The last step. Sesame oil. You feel me? Mmm. These are the moments where you're like, life is actually not horrible, you know? All right, everybody, the moment that we've been waiting for. Here's my panda delivery, here's my creation, and we're gonna taste test the two. Although this experience would not be complete without a box of rice, I just stand rice, rice gang for life. I'm gonna try mine first. I'm kinda scared, but oh God. Mmm. That is not half bad. I'm really shocked. I really thought it was gonna be kind of like whatevs, but see, I told you, though my methods are questionable and clunky and not graceful, you still eat well. Okay, now it's time for the real panda, the real deal. All right. Mm. Mm. It's so good, y'all. I mean, duh, it's Panda Express. I mean, like it goes without saying, like there's nothing like real Panda Express, you know what I mean? Mine's actually not bad, pretty shocked. But anyways, thank you Panda Express for the amazing delivery and the amazing recipe and everything that you're doing for the Asian community. I can now proudly say that I know how to make orange chicken. So listen up everybody, wife me up. But before I let you guys go, I just wanted to quickly encourage you guys to support our amazing charity partner, Asian Americans Advancing Justice. They're taking a stand against racism and what our community is facing right now. Any and all donations raised during this broadcast will help support the super important work that they do. So go do that, do some good, represent. All right, everyone, I'm gonna be wolfing this down um, in two minutes. Bye.